Hello, in this video I'm going to talk about Robert Hunter, who was a songwriter who wrote for a number of different famous performers, but most notably he wrote most of the lyrics to the original Grateful Dead songs. And he was an old friend of Jerry Garcia before the Grateful Dead was formed. He, was, he played in bands with Jerry and they would co-write songs. And the Grateful Dead started getting a lot of their fame around the time of the Ken Kesey acid tests. And Robert Hunter actually was a participant in the studies done by Stanford University on the use of psilocybin and LSD and mescaline. And that was a study done in partnership with CIA and MK Ultra. And so he had a lot of experience with those medicines and he wrote the first lyrics for Grateful Dead when he was under the influence of LSD and he wrote them down and sent them in the mail to the Grateful Dead saying here's some lyrics for a new song and Jerry wrote the music to it and that song was China Cat Sunflower and his name was originally Robert Burns, and it turns out that he was the great-great-grandson of the famous Scottish poet Robert Burns. And so if you think about it, you think of like one of the greatest poets of all time. Several generations later, his great-great-grandson, who inherited that poetic ability is under the influence of LSD writing songs that become the songs of the Grateful Dead. And a lot of people make jokes about the music of the Grateful Dead being, you know, like music that's only good when you're under the influence of psychedelics. And I think that their music is definitely good and worth a lot and has so many amazing associations for people with a connection to this band even when you're not under the influence of psychedelics but there definitely is like jokes aside a lot of amazing power of these songs to be heard in conjunction with the healing med medicine journeys that people are undertaking at Grateful Dead concerts and concerts of their um, progenitors, like the, the bands um, formed by the surviving members of Grateful Dead, like Further and Dead and Company and all of the amazing cover bands. So I just think, well, yeah, it's really good medicine music for these medicine journeys. What's wrong with that? And my connections with Grateful Dead were largely from other people in my life being really into them. When I was a teenager and even younger, a lot of my cousins who I grew up with and my brother were really into the Grateful Dead. And the first band I played in in high school was a Grateful Dead cover band. And it kind of just happened to be what my friends wanted to play and I wanted to play with my friends. So that's the music we did. And when I got into bluegrass, I had a lot of friends in the bluegrass scene who were huge fans of Grateful Dead and got into it through, got into bluegrass through Grateful Dead. And Grateful Dead does a lot of bluegrass songs. And Jerry Garcia was a bluegrass banjo player before Grateful Dead even. He grew up listening to Grand Old Opry and Bill Monroe and a lot of bluegrass music when he was a kid in the 40s and 50s. And he was also influenced by soul and R&B and jazz and blues. And you can hear all that and they're playing too. But um, So he co-wrote most of the songs with Robert Hunter. And I chose a song that really speaks to me, written by Robert Hunter and Jerry Garcia, called Ripple. And for me, this song is about finding your connection as a musician 
feeling a relationship with something divine and spiritual beyond just the mundane world and your desire to just create more music in the world and from a spiritual perspective and be a leader in the healing of the world through being an artist and a musician. And a lot of the Grateful Dead songs have synchronicities that they create when they're being performed in concert. And I find as a busker, a lot of synchronicities come up with a lot of my more spiritual songs. And um, this is one of the more spiritual cover songs that I do. And a lot of interesting things will happen when I'm out on the street performing this. So here is Ripple by Robert Hunter and Jerry Garcia. <laughs> Thank you. 